And all new at five family and friends are mourning the loss of a teenager killed in a hit and run on South Padre Island. CBS 4's Tiffany Huertas has the latest on this investigation and how city officials are helping the family during this time. Tiffany. Marcy, South Padre Island Police Chief Randy Smith tells CBS 4 charges have now been upgraded to manslaughter for 20-year-old Daisy Joy Decker, who was arrested in connection to this hit and run. Today, the family of 19-year-old Maria Celina Patino of Los Fresnos spent their day organizing funeral services. Patino was walking with her friends on the 4200 block of Gulf Boulevard early Friday morning when the group was reportedly struck by Decker. Right now, 20-year-old Cecilia Leija, who was also struck remains in critical condition. Today, Los Fresno CISD sent out this statement, quote, saying they are saddened by the death of Selena Patino, a 2015 graduate. She was a member of the JV girls soccer team in 2014. She was described as sociable and friendly. They add their thoughts and prayers are with her family. The mayor of South Padre Island, Barry Patel, also sent out this statement. It is extremely sad to see a life so young with so much promise and so tragically. He adds the city is reaching out to the family and will be supportive of any memorial service they would wish to have on the island. Tonight, Decker remains in custody. Tomorrow, the funeral services for Patino will be held at the Garza Funeral Home in San Benito. In the studio, Tiffany Huerta, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.